Welcome to our Arkel Academy channel. In this training video, we will provide information about Arcode 101 error code. This training video is intended for informative purposes only and prepared for experienced and certified experts in the elevator field. The assembly or maintenance personnel is responsible for taking all the necessary precautions to prevent any accidents during assembly. When the recall or inspection hand terminal are switched to recall or inspection mode, unless any direction button is pressed, the 120 signal must be off. 0.5 seconds after one of these hand terminals is switched to the inspection mode, if 120 does not go off, this error is occurred. The purpose of this error is to protect the installer or maintenance technician against any possible dangers. If 120 is still on in recall or inspection modes, that means all emergency stop buttons are bridged. And when it's needed to make an emergency stop, it will not stop the motor or car, because emergency stop buttons are already bridged. If this error is given during installation phase, the temporary bridges for the safety circuit should be checked. If there is an incorrect bridge, the bridge should be removed and reconnected as explained. On KBK12 and 13 board, the bridging is made between 110 to 110, 111 to 113, 119B to 120, 120 to 130, 130 to 133, 133 to 135, 135 to 137, and 137 to 140. If the ER101 error is only received when car top inspection hand terminal is used, our code firmware update may not have been performed after the connection of the inspection box board was done. During the firmware update, make sure that FXCAN is found and updated if FXCAN is used as the inspection box board. And if IBCS is used, IBC is found and updated. The firmware update process will be initiated as follows. Press the Tools button and go to Firmware Update screen. Then, select the date at the top of the list and press Enter button to start firmware update. The date at the top of the list is the latest version. During the firmware update, it is observed that the IBC card is found and updated. If the inspection box board cannot be found during the update, the car CAN bus line connection of the inspection box board should be checked. If the connection is correct, the board may be defective. It must be tried with a new board. After the firmware update, the communication of the inspection box board can be verified on the CAN bus communication status screen. Although the safety circuit connections are correct and the board found during the update, if this error is received, the direction signals of hand terminals should be checked. In car top inspection mode, 501 signal should be received when pressed up and 500 signal should be received when pressed down. This can be monitored on the IBC input output status screen. In the pit inspection mode, 505 signal should be received when pressed up and 504 signal should be received when pressed down. This can be monitored on the DFC input output status screen. In recall mode, 503 signal should be received when pressed up and 502 signal should be received when pressed down. This can be monitored on the controller input output status screen. For more information, please visit our website and check our user manual. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on the notifications to get notified about our new training videos. We hope to see you in our next Arkel training video. Goodbye!